one of the most important ancestors of the piano was the harpsichord, a keyboard instrument where the strings were being plucked to produce a sound instead of being hit with a soft hammer. The keys of the harpsichord were quite light and they could be easily depressed by using the separate action of our weak finger muscles. So keyboard technique did appear as a finger-only activity, but in those times it was more or less adapted to the mechanics of the instrument. This doesn't mean that whole arm action wouldn't have worked better. I know from personal experience how comfortable it is to play the harpsichord by using the whole arm technique. However, because finger action did a decent job at the time, there was no reason to invent something new. The simplest solution was enough. However, when the first version of the piano was invented more than 300 years ago, everything started to change.